but yeah, I don't, I don't know if I, I might just, you know, get the, uh, the other one back up there and, um, and stuff. Ooh, that doesn't look bad. Did fix the color though. Well, I'll, I'll try to match it to that. Um, I guess we'll go with the, um, the biker because it matches. Let's go with that. Wait. Multi pouch. Oh, metal head. Um, formal. Wait, oh, death head. I'm like, oh, I thought, I thought it was his father's head at first. <laughs> biker. Um, I guess we'll. Mm, tech. I guess we'll go with that. Legs. Feet. Wall feet. Um. Someone. Reversal. Um. Military opera. One piece. Oh, I thought they were making a One Piece like anime um, uh, thing for a minute. I'm like, oh, 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 shit. <laughs> um, jeans, ice, formal, flex suit. Name on. I don't don't judge me for saying that. <laughs> um, cargo, business, brief. But those those are not briefs. But um. Battle Mage, Basic Suit, Arcane. Well, what was the uh, what's the chest? Oh, Urban. S oh, oh, wait. Trench coat and Urban Slick. I guess we'll go with Urban Slick for the leg. Biker, Business Casual. I forgot there's a lot of these in here. Um, is there, there, there are urban slick? Oh, there are. Okay, I think I think she can do this. I think she can wear those. Yeah, colors. Uh, skin, hair. How about we, we make that? Her hair a little um, um I don't know how about oh her hair doesn't look too bad like that I thought I was just guessing with this type of color. That works. Oh yeah, that works perfectly. And the eyes. Well, you know how most superheroes' eyes are white and like... Okay, no, not black. Not all the way black. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I think this works. Um, yeah, works pretty well. Successful. Actually, no. You know what? I'm gonna go back on some things. Wonder Woman, Quantum, Dual Wield, Acrobatics. I was gonna do so Acrobatics, but let's do Flight because, I mean, she already has the cape and everything, so why not? And, um, let's see. Okay, everything is... Oh, wait. Um... Builds, monarch, small, customize, 
Uh, I, I, I do like the hair. I really do. Defcon. Um. The pixie. Oh wow. Spiky. Flat top. I, I, I guess we'll go with Spiky. I mean, it's not bad, but it's, you know, hey. Download successful. Now, I'm going to let you guys know, I suck at names. Like, I suck at them. So, um, how about... Oh my gosh. Bear with me if it sucks, okay? Like, let me know in the comment section if I should, like, really change it or something. I don't know if I'll be able to do that because, you know, I haven't played DC in a long time. So, you know. Uh, how about... Um... Uh, Captain... Oh, oh wow, did I even spell that right? <laughs> Captain, yeah. Oh, oh shit. Captain... Uh, no, that wouldn't even work. I was gonna say Captain Speeding. It wouldn't work. Mrs. Bullet. Oh wow. Earth. Okay. Okay. That worked. The center of the multiverse. Mrs. It will belong to Brainiac. I do now you guys might understand why I called her that because of the gun. I, have identified I don't think there would ever be a character called Mrs. Knowledge. Bullet in DC or in the Justice League because they probably look at, look at that character like the hell is the name of that? But, you know, hey, DC Universe, anything is possible. <laughs> so, you know, this is gonna be like, I'm gonna try to turn this into a series if possible. The journeys of Mrs. Bullet, you know, like all the way up until like, like, it seems like she reaches level 30 or whatever. So, hopefully, I can turn this into a successful series. Hopefully. So, like I said, join me on the journey of Mrs. Bullet, guys. <laughs> It's gonna be awesome. Intriguing. There is an Freaking awesome. in Earth's atmosphere. Beginning analysis. These exobytes are my own technology, each one holding unknown stores of digitized power from Earth's future. Yeah, thanks my for the losers. will simply reclaim the data provided by these exobytes and seal Earth's fate. So you're gonna kidnap everyone who has your oh, wow, okay. This well. is a new obstacle. These humans resist my assimilation. My conversion cannot hold them. Let the humans use their powers. Oh shit. In the end, they too will belong to Brainiac. Everyone belongs to you almost, dude. You would think, like, start off in the game, they, they should only make you wear default clothing until, like, you reach Earth, and then you have to start wearing, like, superhero clothing until, like, you get there. But, you know, hey, that's just me, though. Thank you, I'm about All right, Mrs. Bullet, let's do this. And free. <sighs> okay, I'm Oracle, and we are gonna get you off this ship. Look for a doorway out. Okay. Um. Did, did, oh, oh, okay. They broke my hack. The ship knows you're free. Watch out. I mean, 
Dude, like, oh. Get ready. My readings show forces gathering beyond that door. Okay, like, where do you feel the door? It's going to be a whole lot easier. <laughs> Alright, let's see this. Ah, oh shit. It's like she's aiming to just you with a mad, just like you kept her on the ground or whatever. Gather reinforcements. I will patrol towards the prison bay. But you just killed him. So, what's the difference? I was, I was gonna say, like, it looks like my bullets aren't doing a thing to him. Bullet. Was an overseer. <laughs> Let's get you out of their patrol range. Look for a transport tube above you. They crisscross the ship. Use that to keep moving. Level two. What are we talking about? Um, power points. Iconic powers. Um. Oh, oh, crap. Technically, since, um, well... Uh, um... We need to talk here and we're not going to be stunning and causing damage. Let's do that. Because I think this is on my old power at one point. For one All of units. On my other theory. The subject I mean, on my has other left the side. main corridors. Search the vessel. Okay. Um. Oh, what's this? Um, can I, uh, okay, yeah. Can I just uh, throw that? <laughs> um. Inventory screen. Um. Like style. Oh, and yeah, I can change my. Speaking of uh, hair, I can change that whenever I feel like it or whatever. You know. Um, these are all the stuff I can, you know, switch to and everything, you know, like primary weapons. Like, I have a simple pistol for now, but, you know, pretty sure everything, I'll change it, some other things along the way. But, um, yeah. Um, you know, they give you, like, when you start the game off, like, when you get, like, straight to, like, you know, the place you need to be after you get off Brainiac ship, they, um, give you, like, other weapons, you know, and if it's all on green stats, you know, that means it's really good, and you feel like, you know, you're getting your ass kicked using them, so, you know, they're good until that point. <laughs> the entire ship is connected to Brainiac, you have to keep moving. And move, I shall do. Oh, wait, if I don't get lost, okay. Get ready. The ship is sending more security your way. Oh, oh gosh, oh no. You know, I really don't remember the brain of the, uh, like in the old version. Well, I can't say older version because, I mean, you know. I guess before they update, updated the game, Brainiac robots didn't look all, you know, did look like that. It, they had a different look to them. Like how those guys look up over there, you know, that's how they look at that point. Um, but uh, overall, this game is, you know, good for people who are, like, interested in making, like, a character and, you know, giving them their own persona and stuff like that. Me, on the other hand, it took me a while to get into, like, a game style like this because I was never, like, really into, like, MMOs and stuff like that. But, you know, my uncle got me to really keep the fitter and, you know, ever since then, you know, I've been playing it, playing as my character, the Envoy. But once again, all the credit goes to my uncle who, you know, made that character and just got me started. I reached level 30 on that character not too long ago.